Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'll be talking with you guys about my Chanel Deville. So this is the Deville bag that I purchased last year. It was part of the 2022 Spring Summer Collection and I really love it because I've always wanted to have a Deville but each time they launched the Deville in their collections, they would look too funky. They had like gold shimmery silver threads um, all over the place or it's like multicolored bag I really hate that I just want a plain simple bag so finally this bag came along it's just like plain pink simple Deville bag and I'm so happy so in this video we're gonna talk about uh, the pros and cons um, what's the difference between the newest version of the Deville compared with the older version and what's in my bag and hopefully some modeling shots so let's jump into the difference between the old and the new one i think it's important to know so first of all um let's talk about the straps in the old version it was just a full chain strap so like the chain would really weigh on people's shoulder and people in their videos would complain that it really digs into a shoulder and hurts you now this time with the new version, it has a leather piece that goes, that sits over shoulders. So it's really a game changer. Um, number two is that the new version has a pouch. It is detachable and it comes with a pouch, which is really quite similar with the Louis Vuitton Neverfull. So I think that's a plus. And the last thing that I noticed is that the bag stays more upright because in other uh, videos that I've watched uh, with the old version, they complained that over time the bag would start slouching, it would lose its shape, um, so you need to put like an insert inside the bag. Um, honestly with this new one, I haven't put any insert. I've tried many times to just leave it sitting upright and it would not even slouch, like it would stay upright for sure, like some parts would slouch a bit but in general it would just stand up right and so i think structure wise it's more stronger so i really like if you're considering like getting um a deville bag but you don't know if you want to get second hand um with the cheaper uh, with the older version or get a more expensive bag but it's the newer version i would really lean towards the newer version because i think you can really fully enjoy the bag because one of the bad side of this bag is that it is quite heavy it is a heavy bag um it's pretty heavy as you fill in things it'll get really heavy but because it's so pretty like you would just like take on the weight <laughs> so but you know like having this leather piece um part of the chain i think that will like alleviate uh, a bit of the the pain carrying this bag so aside from this bag being heavy um i think it's it's a really pretty bag very very nice i'm i'm so in love with this bag um also the other con it would be um you have to carry this bag according to the weather so if it rains a lot i mean i don't recommend to use this bag uh, I tried while it was snowing, <laughs> while it was snowing, while um, uh, while it was raining a bit, like a normal average kind of raining, it was fine, it didn't have any damage. And also because it's like tweed, so you really have to make sure that you don't dirty the bag. Um, yeah, so that's it. I mean, if I have to choose between like the, the, the Dior, um, tote bag and this one i think this one over time would last longer than the um dior tote because although the dior tote is really pretty like all the embroidery and the, like it's, it's just very well done aesthetically it's it looks more complicating than than weaving this um but in terms sorry in terms of like maintaining the bag um I think the Dior tote, you have to be really careful. This one, you can be a, you can be less careful. Like you don't have to like worry too much. Like the corners would um, 
wear off or something like the Dior tote um yeah I think it's okay and the stitching is really nicely done so and I really love the detail I'm gonna show you here here it says like um the address of the original Chanel store um yeah it's really nice okay so let's move on to what's in my bag so now we're gonna go over what's in my bag so first of all i have my shawl this is a shawl from a louis vuitton that i really like it's really warm it's made of silk and whenever it's like cold and windy then i just wrap it around my neck like this so really keeps me warm at the same time i can use it to hide my things since the deville doesn't have a zipper closure only has the magnetic snap um i just fear sometimes that um people can reach into my bag so i like to and i don't want people to peek what's inside my bag so i would just put the shawl over like this so like that it's more discreet okay and then i have a i have my headphone and i have two reusable bags because sometimes when i go shopping and, and I need bags since they don't give out plastic bags anymore sometimes they don't even give any paper bags so I'd rather use my own reusable bags um, and then I have a pouch for very handy if I have my period I also have a self-help book so um, I just go like um i just stop and go with the book uh, i haven't really finished reading but it's just when i'm waiting for a friend or i'm waiting for the bus then um i can read some 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 quotes um also uh in this pouch that comes with the bag i have my muji pens and really cute mini highlighters and um, so when I read a book or something I want to highlight interesting quotes um, I can just use these highlighters um, well since we're talking about the pouch the Chanel pouch I have a plastic bag you never know like especially if you order a takeout um, and um, sometimes with the paper bag it just leaks out and goes through the paper bag um, so sometimes you really need a plastic bag, so this can come in handy. I have a disinfectant towel just to like clean the surface of the table if I find it like uh, really dirty. Um, I also have an extra napkin, like, like when I go to the restaurants and they actually give out extra napkins, I like to hoard napkins because you never know. And then I have a little notebook so sometimes if you get inspiration or there's something funny that i like to write it down to remember because it's really memorable then i would just write it um and then um now i'm gonna show you guys the different compartments in this in, in this bag so there is a zipper compartment here that goes across the bag and it has so much room you can put so many things inside so i have my phone and i also have a long wallet from louis vuitton i really love long wallets because um i just want to be able to put like everything in the wallet and everything is just more or like well organized and easy, easy to reach so i'm glad that the chanel Deville has a big zipper compartment so I can at least hide my wallet and my phone in the zipper compartment. And then on the opposite side, there's two open pockets. So that's where I can put like, I have this um, paper tissue, Hello Kitty. I really love it. It's so cute. And uh, it, I find it also matches with the bag. I don't know, somehow they just match very well. 
um, and then yeah, that's it. And then there's like a divider you see over here. So I'm not sure what's the purpose, but I guess you can put an umbrella. I would put my water bottle, bottle, and um, what else? Oh, I have my hand cream. So um, this is from Sephora. You can get a Sephora. It's Skin Fix, and. Um, it's good for eczema, so I use it as a hand cream. And especially in the winter, it really, it's really, um, it's really effective to protect your skin. And what else? Yeah, that's about it. So all this stuff that was in my bag actually just filled half of this bag. This bag is so huge; it's like a bottomless pit. So um, you can definitely put more things. So if you have to bring. I don't know, a pair of sneakers because you're going to work out and going to the gym. That's possible. If you want to, if you want to put your like your sport wear, um, yeah, you can put in your entire outfit, sport outfit in the bag. Yeah, so it's it could be a workout bag. Um, yeah, yeah, I guess it can also serve as a diaper bag too. It's just really roomy and. Um, I really love it. 